The eagle is a fascinating bird. Known for its power and ability to fly at high altitudes in the sky. It flies where no other bird can fly. Eagle is often called as conqueror of sky. Here are six important lessons we can get from the life of an eagle. Eagles fly alone. Associate with people who are at your level or who can help you to grow. Find people who think like you so that you can both dream and grow together. Don't waste your time with naysayers and negative people. And don't share your dreams with just anybody. You've got a dream? Protect it. Eagles have excellent vision. To catch their prey, they focus on it with laser-like intensity and set out to get it. Do the same with your goals. Focus on one thing to accomplish, at a time. Give it your effort, time and energy. Focus and set out to achieve it. Eagles don't eat dead animals. Don't waste your energy and time beating a dead horse. Know when to say goodbye and let go. Keep your options open and your information current. Do your research and preparation. Keep things current and keep them moving. Eagles love a storm. They get excited when storm clouds gather because they welcome the challenge it brings. They know the storm winds will lift them above the clouds where they can rest their wings and become stronger. Get excited about the storms in your life. Challenges bring opportunities. We could see the opportunities wrapped in our challenges if we weren't so busy complaining and trying to avoid them. Embrace our challenges and learn from them. That's how we learn new skills, grow and get stronger. The eagle is a master of change management. The mother eagle carefully prepares the nest for its eggs. When it is time for the eaglet to learn to fly, the mother begins to remove the comfort layers from the nest, exposing the pricks and sticks. She then throws the eaglets out of the nest. She does this repeatedly until the eaglet learns to fly. Out of fear, the eaglet jumps back in the nest with each attempt, shrieking and bleeding from the pricks in the nest. The mother doesn't yield. To others looking on this, may seem heartless. But there is a method to the madness. The process is repeated, until the eagle eventually starts flapping its wings, getting stronger and stronger with each flap. Lesson is, we must not become complacent in life, clinging to the old and familiar. We can only grow, if we are willing to step out of our comfort zone. The thorns or pain in life are there, to tell us that, there is nothing more for us where we are, and it is time to move on, grow and spread our wings. Further, the people who genuinely care about us, will not encourage us in our slothfulness and fear. While their treatment may seem unkind, it is for our ultimate good. Sometimes tough love is best. They don't want us to die in our nest. Rebirth involves death of the old self. The eagle has to make a painful decision at around age 40. Die or go through a painful process of rebirth, which will extend its life for 30 more years. This process involves the painful task of knocking out its own beak, 
and plucking out its talons, so that new ones can grow. This entire process takes about five months to complete. Lesson is, no pain, no gain. Many of us want success or change, but without the sacrifice, handwork, disappointments and heartbreak, that comes with it. To survive and grow, we must be willing to change. And sometimes, we may even need to go a step further, a death of the old self, and a total rebirth. Ending toxic relationships, leaving toxic jobs, getting rid of destructive habits, thoughts, traditions and mindsets, that no longer serve us. These are some great lessons, from the life of an eagle. If you find it helpful, then don't forget to give like, and subscribe my channel, thank you so much for watching.